So guys, welcome back to another video. Fossil News Show back again. We've got once again lots to talk about. So let's get straight into it all. Okay, so the first thing is Bakayo Saka. Uh, finally, finally confirmed with this new Arsenal deal. Start the party. Bakayo Saka stays until 2027, uh, which is how long he's extended till. He is reportedly on a new wage of £290,000 a week, which is £15 million a year. So a lot of money being earned by Bakayo Saka, and he deserves it. You know, only the top players earn £300,000 a week, and he is a top player. So there's no denying that. If you try and deny it, then you are you know you're wrong inside. Bakayo Saka, good to have you staying at the club. I think he's a great English star, great English talent. Uh, you know, clubs were interested in him. Liverpool and Manchester City are all clubs that were interested in the star boy, but we have managed to get him down to this new deal and the video is great take a watch of the video dreams don't come true overnight it takes time this club has been a family to me since i was eight years old it's given me everything and i've given everything back i know how much we can achieve together Time is on our side. Yeah, he says in there, this is our club. Uh, it took him a while to get to his dream, which was, of course, play for the Arsenal. But, Bakayo, you got there in the end and you have shown for us. My Arsenal family, the contract signed. I'm here to stay. So many more years with you guys. See you all soon. Reese Nelson has had a new offer. Uh, this is probably the fourth or fifth, to be honest. It is a new contract, four-year offer from Arsenal. Uh, not sure how much wage, but the four years is all I've heard. He is a player this season that has come off the bench at late times and has changed the game. He's been brilliant this season. He's had his best season in an Arsenal shirt. Obviously scoring that goal against Bournemouth, uh, the late winner. Everyone thought that that was going to be the goal to win us the league. But then, nope, uh, it's not because we go and lose and lose and lose. Brooke Norton Coffee for Coventry is uh, in a championship playoff final. So he could get Coventry promoted to the Premier League, uh, the Arsenal loan talent. At the start of the season, he signed this new contract. He went out on loan to Rotherham. I'm not really sure how it went for him at Coventry, but then he came back in January and went straight back on loan to Coventry, who are now in the Championship playoff final. Brilliant achievement for him if he gets them promoted. He is missing the Under-20 World Cup for this final. Hopefully, we can see Coventry in the Premier League for him up against Luton Town, who have the craziest away end in football. You literally have to walk through someone's house. And guys, Project Youth is back again. We have now been linked with some Brazilian 35 million pound euro. 35 million euro star striker, Victor Ike. I don't know who the guy is, but surely he must be decent if he's worth 35 million euros. We were linked back with him a few months ago and uh, we have now heard that well, the starting price will be 35 million euros. <laughs> so, yeah, will Edu go back to Project Youth, go back to Brazil? As I said, I don't really know much about him, but if he comes and he's good, then good sign him. But if not, then... Not a great signing, I guess. That's about it. New deals. Pretty much 
everywhere now. Uh, we're still waiting for Odegaard to uh, to sign one. But other than that, well, and Saliba. We're waiting for Saliba to sign one as well. But yeah, that's it for this one. See ya tomorrow. Young Pakao Saka, 17 years of age, makes his debut. Saka looks towards goal. Curls it. Oh, yes! What a way to score your first goal for Arsenal. Saka. Oh! Fantastic goal! Pakao Saka! Even get to